Hey, Shalonda Gordon here, and I just wanted to go over how you can create a personalized email signature. And I just wanted to basically get you started so that you can put this signature at the bottom of any of your emails that you send out. If you create autoresponders, you can put them at the bottom of your autoresponders. It just really looks really professional and crisp. Well, we start out by going to wisestamp.withshalonda.com. And by the way, I am Shalonda Gordon, and I want to thank you for joining me today. So this is where we're going to start okay so you'll go to the website you can basically just click the link below to get to it okay and that is going to bring you to this site here okay this is your Y stamp email signature site what you're going to do first is you're going to do the free download okay you can always upgrade if you want to do some more trickier things and that kind of thing that's perfectly fine I work on Firefox and so this is where I create um, where I'm using if you're using Firefox then this is how you would download it. You would basically have to allow the plugin. If you're using um, Google Chrome or if you're using Internet Explorer, it will basically explain to you what to do, but you need to download Y stamp onto your computer, okay? Now, once you have done that, I've already actually downloaded this on here. So once you've done that, you'll be able to log in to your Y stamp app, okay, that's downloaded on your computer. So you'll be able to click and start. Basically, you're gonna get a screen that's gonna come up telling you your first steps. So once you download it, it's gonna bring you to this screen right here. Basically, is your first steps, okay? So when you're here, it'll give you the opportunity to basically start or um, start to put in your preferences for your sig signature that you're gonna place on your email. So what you're gonna do here, if it doesn't automatically pop up, just do Control Alt. W and then it'll pop up right there for you okay and I was actually playing around here okay so you have your email apps here that you're allowed to feature you have your social icons here you are able to type in here whatever personal details you want on there okay you can also do templates that will show you pretty much pretty cool things to start with I usually like the first one with your logo and then the information on the side for you and so now if you want more different types of templates, you'd need to upgrade. But I usually do the first one. I like to put my logo here. So I'll insert my picture, upload my file. It's very simple to do, guys. You're just going to go to your computer, pick a picture, let it upload, and then insert it in. You can, um, of course, it's a little large here, so I'm going to go ahead and make it a little smaller so that this all works out the way I want it to go. Okay, so there that is. And then I'm just gonna go up here and I'm simply gonna change out this information up here. And I'm going to spell my name right, okay. So as I'm changing out this information up here, you see you have the fonts already pretty much chosen for you. Okay, and then you have your phone numbers here. I usually don't, I don't have a mobile that's on there. I mean, it is a mobile phone number that I'm giving everybody, but it's pretty much just my regular contact number. And then my website, you know, and then after my website, I'm definitely going to put a link there, right guys? Because you want them to be able to click on it and get directly to your website. You don't want them to have to not, it not be clickable. So you want them to be able to do this. So make sure you do that part, insert that. So now it's a link, it's a domain. So I'm going to use these. I've already set this up, but you'll click on social icons and you can choose which social medias you want them to connect to. And as you do this, it's going to add this to your signature. So they can literally click on your signature and go to your Facebook page, your Twitter page, your LinkedIn. I choose YouTube. As you can see here, you can add and there are several other ones you can go through and choose. Um, there's even like Google Plus now on there. Dig, just lots of other ones 
that you can choose from as well if you have a Ning site and all of that there's many others you can choose from I personally just stick with Facebook Twitter LinkedIn and YouTube these are the places I spend most of my time yet depending on what's best for your business you would need to make that decision as well now feel free to play around with this you can play around with your fonts you can play around with your bold the color of it you can decide that you don't like the gray you might want a different color um, for your name you can go in and click here make it green I like green it's one of my favorite colors so you can do that as well you can make it a little wider and that kind of thing or you can bring it back in and make it smaller that's all up to you and then you're gonna apply okay so as you click apply everything gets applied and then you say okay congratulations your signature will now automatically appear in your emails so you'll go here and you can go up here to send your email and there is your signature you see it's on your emails right there every time you decide to send a message your signature is going to pop up from now on like yahoo go dad i mean yahoo gmail you can go ahead and just begin to send an email and it will send it here all the time if you don't like it and you want to take it off you can go right here you can edit it you can do business if you have a business one so you know then i say no not now thanks or if you have none you can put none if you don't want one there but right now we have the personal one set there and that will go there and that will be the email address that they get as you see they have the clickables here at the bottom for them to click on they can click on my web address as well and that is how you can create a signature for your emails that go out I really hope this was helpful for you and have an amazing day and as always keep smiling